Well, how do the chums? As I'm Captain Steve, and today, chums, I've got a bit of anti-news for you guys in the viewerverse. Yes, this is anti-news. When I say anti-news, it means that the news that I predicted hasn't actually come true. <laughs> no, my speculation seems to be a freaking mile off. Then again, we don't know. We don't know. It could happen any time now. Who knows? Anyway, execute a mondo. So, we know that the depots have been updated, and they've been updated again just two days ago. The sales are on on all platforms, PlayStation, Steam and on Xbox, all the normal signs that something is due to drop when it comes to an update are there, chums. Now it's not just I that has set this expectation, no, Hello Games over on their LinkedIn and also on Patch Notes have mentioned that there'll be regular updates and they've mentioned 6 to 8 weeks. Yes, they're actually asking for people to join. Hello Games, on the hype train for every 6 to 8 weeks. There will be updates appearing inside of the game and inside of the verse. And because this has been put up by Hello Games, you may as well say that it's been put up by Sean of the Murrays himself. So yes, the hype train is fully engaged. But yeah, it's on those rails, thanks to Hello Games and the expectations that they have set out in the verse. Now there was also that leak about the Twitch drops that should be occurring between July 15th and 18th. It did sort of come from a trusted sort of source in a roundabout way, however it looks like that has not come to fruition. So despite all of these signs and all of the expectations setting out there in the verse, it would appear that this is false expectations and sadly the hype train has been delayed. Heck yes. So as you know, whenever we get quite a large patch or update come into the verse, it usually comes with a load of bug fixes and quality of life enhancements. Now, I am experiencing a fair few bugs. Like this one, this is just an example bug that I get from time to time. Now this one causes any sort of particle effects that come from like either my mining tool or from my feet or from damaged machinery to show as these black sort of, I don't know, dustbin bags. Yeah, look at that, even my jetpack is completely foobarred. Now, the only way to get around this currently for me is to completely exit the game. Even loading of my autosave doesn't seem to fix the issue. I also have problems at um, archives. Sometimes ships don't land, sometimes they do, which is a little bit squiffy and a little bit odd. But yeah, I've done bug videos on squiffiness and other bugs that are still plaguing the current iteration, and I'm hoping to see some of these nailed because at the moment I've got problems doing base tours as well. Sometimes they don't render. Also, renaming. Renaming seems to be a hit, hit and miss. Sometimes it only uploads half the creatures that I've uploaded, which is a bit strange, or planet names. Yeah, it seems to be very squiffy at the moment, chums, and I don't know what's going on, so I'm hoping we get an update mainly to help polish off what we have currently. So, chums, there we go, that's what I've got for you, basically, is an apology. But I also have something in way a meaning of why this may have been delayed. So yes, although we haven't got this in the verse at the moment, chums, it could be that it's on its horizon. It's on its way soon. Yeah, and you're probably thinking, well, you haven't been right so far, Captain Steve. However, take a look at this. So PT has just put this up. The Procedural Traveller has just put this up today in the last, like, 26 minutes, chums. And yes, it's in French, but basically it says that it may have been delayed due to technical reasons, chums. So there we go, people. I have a little bit of news for you, a little bit of hope that we might see this, yeah, I know, in a couple of weeks. A couple of weeks! Okay, but at least, hopefully, it's going to be a bug-free one. We can, but hope! Yeah, I mean, this is another leak from, you know, Twitch streamers. So you take this with a pinch of salt, but at the same time, it's all we've got at the moment, chums, to go on. So I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you again soon. Goodbye, goodbye, and goodbye again. Well, thank you very much for watching. If you like what you see, please hit a like and a subscribe. And I'd like to say a massive great big thank you to all of my backers over on Patreon and over on YouTube membership. Thanking you, backers. And if you want to support this channel, just don't skip the adverts. That throws revenue down my avenue. Or yeah, just stay with Captain Steve a little bit longer and hit something on this screen. There's merch here now too.